that was some scary parking. But today, 153, you guys, we are in Gator Country. Go Gators. And here we go. from up here. you know you guys right as I walked out of the stadium I bumped into CC and I forgot I know my brain's a little bit fuzzy at the moment but yeah yeah I got two autographs and I didn't intend on that but that is amazing this has been a good day you guys I know this vlog is still far from over even though I could end it now maybe but I don't know about that. I mean, if 
this meant a lot to me and for the alma mater the college of communications where i came from you know i'll i still love y'all i still support you and that college 110 percent but i'm sorry i can't support tennessee football i just can't so go gators it's a new day it's a rebirth of myself because there are a lot of reasons now Tennessee would probably say like oh you got a lot of negative comments well let me reiterate again one of the most inspirational youtubers that I know of that I've watched even though she lost her battle to cancer one of her major major battles took place here at the University of Florida and that was proton therapy on her leg the other it's my friend Liz Bone Emma who was murdered by her husband she was a Gator fan too and to carry on her legacy I support the Gators I just do and on top of that I'm just sorry like coming here I just got so much love and appreciation like coming into the stadium I felt like someone and you know it wasn't the Gators just it wasn't just us you know talking to one another they did this for the people that were with UT as well you know they weren't ugly when the team was doing bad they were just peaceful and kind and loving and generous and another major reason why I fell in love with Florida you know everybody's kind I mean yeah there are the stereotypical reasons that people are like oh you know Florida's filled with a bunch of jerks that that couldn't be farther from the truth especially for North Florida I have gotten so much love more love than I ever got in my four years at UT like and these were total strangers so that's why I love the University of Florida and I plan on finishing up my second degree here I only need two more classes that's it and then I can go on with my life. I, I mean, I could have finished it at the University of Tennessee, but they were just very ugly towards me. And very, I mean, for somebody, you know, that is a fellow ball for life, they, they still treat you like garbage. So, I'm happy. I got two awesome autographs. I got to support friends from the other side that I look forward to meeting and seeing again one day. And it's by the grace of God. Amen. Praise the Lord. I know I going in here, you know, I've, I had some, about maybe 5%, 10% mixed feelings about my team. Not my team. The balls. I guess I should say my alma mater. But I am happy. So, you guys, I mean, I did it for my friend. I did it for someone who is extremely inspirational and a cornerstone in my life to get me back on my passions again that I feel like my God put their their legacy to help me keep going with my dreams and on top of that just the love that I have gotten so far so we're gonna go back to the boat let's do it and one more thing because I moved to the state of Florida and I wanted to take the opportunity while I could that is my other reason. Smaller reason. Yeah. Also, I found the College of Agriculture. Yeah. To end the day, you guys, I think I'm gonna get some ice cream. Now this is a great way to close the day. Like a phone